rubbing down at all of my officers and members and friends. It's good to be here on this Sunday morning to remind you that God is still in a blessed vision. For he looked beyond our faults and saw all of our needs. So good to see each of you and thank you for your prayers while we were away. Don't forget this afternoon at the five o'clock hour, uh, Pastor Richard Amen. and Grace Fred will be here Amen. at the New Zion Baptist Church at the five o'clock hour. And we invite you to come and share with us at that time. We do want you to pray for uh, the family of Dr. Davis went on home to be with the Lord and then for Sister Denise Hunter and family in the past of that daughter and then the Blackburn family brother and sister Michael Blackburn and Reverend Jesse Blackburn and all the Blackburn family in the past of that brother and so many of them to pray uh, I miss some of the names Blackburn family, pray for them. Say, neighbor, the Lord is good. And he's blessing me right now. Good to see our new members here tonight, today. And we say that thank God for them. But just a little while, a little while this morning, and we're going to be brief. From the book of St. Luke. St. Luke, the seventh chapter. All right. The seventh chapter. And the beginning with verse one. And when you have it, will you say amen? amen? Now when he had ended all, all his saying in the audience of the people, he entered into Capone. Yeah. And a certain centurion servant who was dear unto him was sick and ready to die. And when he heard that, when he heard of Jesus, he said unto him, the elders of the Jews, beseeching him that he would come and heal his servant. And when they came to Jesus, they brought, they besought him, saying, instantly saying that he was worthy whom he should do this. Yeah. For he loveth our nation yeah. and he has built us a synagogue. Yeah. I want to talk today about the centurion faith. Right. The centurion faith. It's another day, John, and I'm glad.
and heal his faith. In that sermon. And when they came to Jesus, they besought him and pleaded with him instantly, yes, saying that he would he was worthy for whom he should do this. Why should why should he do this? Number one, they said that he loves our nation. There are people today who don't love themselves, neither their neighborhood in this earth. For he loved our nation. There are people who have made a lot of sacrifice fighting for the safety of this nation. He left our wives, our children to go and fight for the safety of this nation. This man, this interior said that, 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 that they said to him that, that he's worthy that you overcome. Number one, he loved the nation. And they didn't stop there, but they said that he had built us a synagogue. I wonder, I wonder where would we be today if there were not churches and synagogues? As I ride on the airplane from place to place and Get ready to land. I look down and try to count All right, the number of states yes, sir. Yes, sir. or church building, but I see a lot of houses. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I see, I see swimming pools, yeah, yeah, yeah. but very few set of God. In that yeah. We really don't need no more churches. If the people who said they are born again would make themselves available not only during the 11 o'clock hour, Lord help me, Lord. But doing Bible study, doing Sunday school, isn't that so? Brother, men, I discovered after having stood behind the sacred desk for many months, many Sundays, Many days, I discovered that people that do not get involved in Sunday school and in Bible study are always coming up with some kind of scheme or gimmick to read. Tell somebody that God has the best plan. Not only for his church, but for your life. That's right. Isn't that so? Yeah. I know some people that stand up all day Saturday over the grill selling barbecue chicken dinners and, and many times they shake off they pick up 30 beans and knock 29 of them off yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's right, Pastor. 
And they don't want to charge me 15 dollars. That person, that person, that, that think you can make money by selling chicken dinners to operate God's church is just fooling, fooling. That's right, Pastor. That's right. Better say it. That's right. about 10 more minutes. I'll be sure. God has been paid. That's right, Pastor. That's right. Through times and often. That's right, Pastor. Isn't that so? Yeah. You go to the wrestling hall now. Sit down in all the state. But it is, I want you to walk out that they got to fix now where they have already had in the TV. But that's some people who are still in tension. Yeah, that's right. yeah. Malachi 3. That's right, Shepard. He said, Will a man rob God? Will a man rob his father? Yes, they will. Yes, they will. Will a man rob God? Yes, they will. Yeah, he says, In times and in over. Bring it up. Not sinning unless you're sick. Bring it into the storehouse. Yes, sir. Tell your neighbor, that's what the Bible said. Yes, and tell your other neighbor, Pastor William, just repeating yes, what, 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 what the Bible said. Yes, Bring it into the storehouse. Yes, that thou may be meat in my house. Yes, and then prove me now. Said the Lord, if I will not open you and pour you out blessings that you won't have room enough for. Isn't that so? God been good to us. Think about, think about our strength. Just a few hours ago, yeah. a man killed five people more yeah. That's been good, Pastor. and injured some more. Yes, sir. That's been good. That could have happened That's right. right here in Buffalo at 318 now. That's right. That's right. There are sick people all over our nation. You, you need somebody to protect you because you cannot protect your own self. One of my friends called me the other day and said, Pastor, I need prayer. My daughter has been shot in the head. She's in Intensive care. Yeah. I need prayer. Yeah, and then the other thing, he said, the boy turned around and turned <coughs> the gun on yeah, yeah, yeah. Mad people. Yeah, mad. That's right. My question to you today, do you know who you're hanging around? Good question. Do you know? Whose car you're driving around me? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. You need, you need, you need Dr. Jesus. Oh, yes, I do. Yes, I do. Songwriter said that all night and all day the angel. Watch it over. Yeah. I'm glad that when I lay down, put my head on a pillow, go to sleep in an unfortunate world that I got somebody that's watching over me. Isn't that so? Well, brothers and sisters, 
You need Dr. Jesus. I don't bump it up. Alarm is all right. The lock on our door is all right. But I know some people that will help me today. I know some people that install the burglar alarm. And then they know how Go back in without making in the noise. You need Jesus. Jesus, our Lord and Savior, was about doing good. In other words, everywhere my Lord traveled, he was doing good. He had, he had a record of healing the sick. Yeah. Yeah. It was Jesus who raised Hezekiah from the sick. Yeah. 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 Yes, it was Jesus who healed his mother-in-law from the Jesus had a record of raising dead people back to life. Y'all remember Lazarus, Mary, and Martha. Brother, that brother, yes, who had been dead for four, for four long days. In other words, Jesus was not there. No, no, Jesus. Jesus got the word, the one that you love is now sick. But let me tell you, when Jesus, Jesus did not come at that bad moment, but when he showed up, the record indicated that this man had been dead now for four long days. Oh, tell your neighbor, it's never too late for Jesus. In other words, the sister said, Lord, if you had been here, if you had been around, our brother. <clears throat> Would not be. You know, sometimes you get upset about nothing, but Jesus, you remain. Jesus said to them, just show me where you leave. He did not call. He did not call Lazarus three times. In other words, Jesus does not have to. Repair anything that he made. You haven't read about anybody going to the moon to repair the moon. The moon is just doing what it was. You never read about anybody getting on the ladder going. To fix the stuff. God is able. I said, God is able to do anything but faith. That's one of the reasons I'm going to hold on to God's untruth. So he went by the grave site of Brother Lazarus. He did not call him three times, but just one time. Lazarus, come forward. Isn't that so? Who would want to serve a God that can do the impossible? Yes, it was Jesus who raised 
a widow's son in the city of her name yeah. back to life. Yeah, yeah, Jesus did that. They were on that way to the cemetery. Yeah, but they met a man called Jesus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jesus did not say to the woman, if you need me, send for me. But Jesus sat the possessor. That's right, Pastor. Called the boy back to life. Yeah, yeah. In this earth. Yeah. In other words, in other words, in other words, he breathed. That mother's son back to her. That's right. Go back to her. See him on back home. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Isn't that so? Yeah. Well, you remember Jesus had had a record of feeding multitude on a little boy's lunch. Yeah, yeah. He gave order to the disciples to make the men sit down in groups of 50 and yeah, hundreds. Yeah, yeah. Then Jesus took the lad and launched two fish and uh, yeah, five by the nose of yeah, bread. Yeah, yeah. In other words, Jesus could take uh, nothing and uh, make something. That's right. That's right. This Jesus on that had been known to change life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He had yet been known to speak to the rain and the sea yeah. and the wind lay down like that. Anybody who had that kind of power should make us wanna put our faith. Isn't that so? Yes. This Jesus of Nazareth, yeah, meet the need of all people. Yeah. 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 The child of Jesus. Yeah. The rich and the poor, the leaders are followers. Yeah. Yeah. Rulers are saints. Yeah. Yeah. Isn't this Jesus? Yes, Lord. Yeah. Who bring the gap yeah. of prejudice and the vision between me? Yeah. Yeah. If you and I uh, want the Lord to help us, yeah. we got to have faith. Yeah. Yeah. That's right. That's right. yeah, we must have faith in Christ and His power. Yeah. 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 The fact. Is clearly demonstrating in uh, yeah what happened between the soldier and Jesus. Yeah, that's right, Pastor. That's yeah, here yeah, right. in the text, Jesus returned to the pony. Yeah, yeah. Now, uh, when he had ended all of his saying in the audience other people. Yeah. It is sad that Jesus entered into the phone. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, Jesus meet a centurion son that uh, was dear to his master. That's right. That's right, who was uh, now sick and uh, ready to die. And uh, verse 2 said, a certain centurion said, who was dear unto him? Yeah. Or sick and uh, ready to die. Yeah. Yeah. Considering who we are and who Christ is, yeah. it's enough. Uh, it ought to be, yeah, it ought to make us uh, feel. Uncomfortable to approach Jesus. The centurion heard about Jesus and uh, he sent unto him the elder asking him to come and he. 
And if your daughter or son is in this room and you hear, why don't you come on and join Amen. us yeah. down here? Yeah. We need a Savior. We need a Savior.